Question tax. Question tax. Question tax or short additions to sentences asking for agreement or confirmation. Note. Question tag always begins with a small letter. Question mark is used at the end. The subject of the question tag is always a pronoun. There is a comma after the statement. Rules for framing question tags. If the statement is negative, use positive question tag. If the statement is positive, use negative question tag. After positive imperative sentences, that is for orders, we use won't you, can't you. After negative imperative sentences, that is for orders, Use will you. Helping verbs. Positive sentence. He is helpful. You get a negative tag for it. Isn't he? Is is the helping verb here. So the negative tag will be isn't. So for the question tag, how will you write? He is helpful. Put a comma and write isn't he. I will be small. Small letter. Ronnie was active. Put a comma and write wasn't she. Ronnie was active is a positive sentence and it will have a negative tag. Rani was active. Put a comma and write wasn't she. Similarly, we can do the other question tags. They were clever. Weren't they? You are correct. Aren't you? He has a sister. Hasn't he? Sam does the work. Doesn't he? You will help me. Won't you? Helping verbs. Negative sentence. Positive tag. He is not rude. Is he? She wasn't attentive. Wasn't means was plus not. She wasn't attentive. Was she? They were not bad. Were they? You are not kind. Are you? He did not sing. Did he? She can't dance. Can't means can plus not. She cannot dance. She can't dance. Can she? Tom will not come. Will he? You mustn't run. Must you? He had no pen. Had he? They couldn't sing, could they? It mightn't bite, might it? Semi-negative sentence, positive tag. 
they have made little progress have they because this is a semi negative sentence you have the word little little which makes this sentence negative they have made little progress so it is a semi negative sentence so you'll get a positive tag they have made little progress have they there is hardly any flower on the tree the word hardly shows in uh, the meaning of this uh, sentence to be negative there is hardly any flower on the tree this is a semi negative sentence so the uh, tag will be positive there is hardly any flower on the tree and the helping verb is is so the positive tag will be is there main verbs now we can see the main verbs we have positive sentence he came home see the main verb here the main verb is came came can be split as did plus come because it is a, a verb which is having past tense came can be split as did plus come this is a positive sentence and we'll have a negative tag to it he came home put a comma and write didn't he he comes home here the main verb is comes it can be split up as does plus come so the negative tag will be does in he he comes home does in he they come home here the main verb is come it can be written as do plus come the negative tag will be don't they they come home don't they now look at the next sentence they work hard work is the main verb it can be split as do plus work so the negative tag will be don't they so the sentence will be they work hard don't they now we can see some negative sentences they'll have a positive tag he didn't come home didn't means did plus not he didn't come here the main verb is didn't come so did plus not as didn't it can be splitted as sorry split up as did plus not so the positive tag will be did he he didn't come home did he they don't come here do they because don't is split up as do plus not so the positive tag will be do they she doesn't waste time the positive tag will be does she now we can see some semi negative sentences he scarcely visited the place here the main verb is visited visited can be written as did plus visit so the positive tag will be did he the old man seldom goes out seldom means rarely so this is a semi negative sentence the old man seldom goes out and here the main verb is goes it can be split as does plus go so the positive tag will be does he now we can see for orders don't 
go out don't pluck the flowers these are examples of negative sentences so under orders when you have negative sentences you will have to use positive tag these are called imperative sentences orders are always called imperative sentences don't go out will you don't pluck the flowers will you if you get under orders negative sentences that means under imperative sentences if you are getting negative sentences then you will have to use positive tag now we will see for positive sentence what we a tag we have to use now under orders that is under imperative sentences for positive sentence you will get negative tag study well won't you play in the evening can't you can't you is a softer way of telling you can also say won't you study well you can also tell can't you but if you are uh, telling very sternly then you can use won't you if you are telling strongly then you can use won't you otherwise if you are in a softer tone then you can use can't you study well won't you play in the evening can't you now we can see some special cases see the sentence i am correct or in tail i am not correct am i for am the tag is the negative tag is or in tail i am not correct am i here it is negative you are given a negative sentence so you will get a positive tag and when you are having the word let in the beginning you will have to use shall let us play shall we let me open the door shall i now some things to remember am plus not is equal to aren't is plus not is equal to isn't or plus not is equal to aren't was plus not is equal to wasn't were plus not is equal to weren't has plus not is equal to hasn't have plus not is equal to haven't had plus not is equal to hadn't do plus not is equal to don't does plus not is equal to doesn't did plus not is equal to didn't will plus not is equal to won't shall plus not is equal to shan't would plus not is equal to wouldn't should plus not is equal to shouldn't may plus not is equal to mayn't might plus not is equal to mightn't can plus not is equal to can't could plus not is equal to couldn't must plus not is equal to mustn't dare plus not is equal to daren't need plus not is equal to needn't 
here most of you go wrong with this will plus not is equal to won't shall plus not is equal to shan't so learn it thoroughly